Hi, I'm Vince Byrne. I'm going to take you through uh, cleaning a 178 air gun. Uh, with the 178, uh, with any gun, always make sure it's unloaded first. In this case, we're going to open it up. We have the dark barrel heel. We're going to make sure that the dark barrel is clear. Um, this is the bolt. It's in. It's not in the cocked position, so we're safe there. So with this gun. Um, probably your, your biggest concern is a dart being left in there or the medicine getting out of the dart so you always want to swab the gun out after you've used any uh, darts with medication in them. We're going to go ahead and just take a 2x2 two two pad, put some oil on it. Slide it right through. Pop it out. You can clean it from this end, but when you push, push your patches through, they always catch in this slot. So we'll go ahead and do another one. You're going to repeat that until the patch itself is clear, um, depending on how much use it's got, how much will be in it. Uh, you want to take a look at your O-rings here that are visible, make sure that they're, they're not nicked up at all. Okay. Go. Probably the best overall for these is this area here. Uh, when you start getting a lot of debris and dust and dirt inside of here, it ends up working its way in into the gun and makes it harder harder to use. Uh, there is a hole here that is just for air. You do not want to be putting oil in there. The more oil you put in there, you're going to have more trouble, more misfires with the gun. That's really all it is, is to, is to keep it clean and keep the debris out of here. And that, that's how you clean the barrel. When you've uh, cleaned the gun and, and you've gone ahead and, and you've pumped it or any of the air guns themselves, you do not want to leave pressure on the O-rings. So go ahead and uh, making sure it, it is empty. Go ahead and release the pressure for storage.